So the difference between the Moderna and Pfizer vaccine uh, is actually fairly subtle. Both vaccines are mRNA vaccines. Both of them uh, use the same uh, technology platform to make the vaccine. The differences from the standpoint of the person getting vaccinated are probably minor to none. The effectiveness of the vaccine for both the Moderna vaccine and the Pfizer vaccine are very similar. The effectiveness in older patients, in women, in, uh, in minorities, in uh, people with other medical problems, high blood pressure, heart disease, lung disease, diabetes, for example, or, or significant obesity, all those appear to be very similar between the Pfizer vaccine and the Moderna vaccine. The side effects also seem to be very similar between the Pfizer vaccine and the Moderna vaccine, mostly pain in your shoulder, you know, things like fatigue, headache, uh, um, joint pain, muscle pain. They all seem to be very similar. The differences are really on the side of the person giving the vaccine. The Pfizer vaccine needs to be stored at minus 80, which I think is, you know, mi minus 80 degrees centigrade, which is like a minus 100 uh, Fahrenheit. And it, so it needs to be shipped on dry ice and stored in uh, uh, special freezers. The Moderna vaccine can be stored at minus 20, which is about the temperature of your regular freezer, uh, although, uh, it needs to be still stored in uh, special freezers that, that hold the temperature at minus 20, but it's a lot easier to uh, hold it there. And it's actually good at uh, four degrees, a regular refrigerator for 30 days. The Moderna vaccine has uh, less stringent storage and administration conditions than the Pfizer vaccine. So from the standpoint of a hospital, whether if you're a big hospital or a very small hospital in, the, in, the, in a rural community, those differences probably make are, are important. But if you're somebody getting vaccinated, both vaccines work equally well. If you get dose one through Pfizer, you need to get dose two through Pfizer. And right now they say that if you get dose one through Moderna, you need to get dose two from Moderna. It's important to people uh, to remember if you get what if you get a vaccinated. Uh, by one vaccine for dose one, you need to get vaccinated the same vaccine by dose two. You know, I'm certain that a lot of people are thinking, is one vaccine better than the other? And the data right now says that from a person's standpoint that's getting vaccinated, the answer is that they are both very effective and very safe. There doesn't appear to be uh, anything that is significantly different in terms of both the side effects that you can get the frequency of the side effects and the effectiveness of the vaccine in all the categories that, that have been looked at. So I don't think my personal opinion is that those vaccines from terms of safety and efficacy are pretty much equivalent. So our recommendation is to get the vaccine that you can get, not wait for one versus the other. I don't think that that's important. So get the vaccine that you are able to get uh, and get it as quickly as you can.